Potato Gators! I'm on my way to planet Mars now. But I keep thinking about how we got the second star fragment before Gustav. I had a pretty rough launch into space. But with some help from Peck, we made it to planet Mercury safely. Gustav found the star fragment first. But the heat from the sun and Mercury caused his laser beam to overheat. Thanks to Peck, I had a heat-proof spacesuit and was able to walk out on the surface to grab the star fragment before Gustav. He was so mad. He tried to hit me with his spaceship. There are still three fragments left in our solar system. So let's go, little gators. Wahoo! <laughs> we need to slow down. You're at max speed and you don't have any fuel left. Warning, no fuel. Brace for impact. Ah! Give me that yummy gummy. I'm Gus the Gummy Gator. Push the land button now, Gus! The land button! Uh, uh, just how I planned it. Whoa, wait! I thought almost crashing made me sweat. But I think it's because of the heat. It feels hotter here than on Mercury. Danger! Extremely high temperatures! 880 degrees Fahrenheit! Gus, don't you remember? I told you Venus is the hottest planet in the entire solar system. Anyway, I think now is the best time for you to get your heatproof suit back on, just to be safe. You got it, Peck. But Peck, how are we supposed to refuel the Peck pod if there aren't any gas stations on Venus? Well, Gus, I built two alternative power systems for the Peck pod to operate off of in case of emergency. The first one runs on a standard battery or other contained energy source, and the other runs on carbon dioxide. And, as I'm sure you know, Venus's atmosphere is 96.5% carbon dioxide. Wow! That's spectacular planning there! Way to go, Peck! It is quite spectacular, if I do say so myself. <laughs> now go ahead and press the yellow button on the dashboard. This will change the power system over to carbon dioxide. The Peck Pod's fuel is at 100%. Way to go, Peck! You're a genius! Oh, popsicles. Now let's get out of here before I become Gus the Fried Gummy Gator! Whoa! There's the planet Mars! I had no idea it was so red! Yes, Gus. Mars is nicknamed the Red Planet because of how red it is. And it gets its red color from all the rust in its atmosphere. Uh, Peck, what's going on? <laughs> oh, I forgot to tell you Mars's gravity is about one-third times that of Earth's. But don't worry, Gus. I've already planned for this, too. I'll activate your magnetic boots from ground control. Woo! Saved me again! I don't know how I would... Wow! Look! The star fragment is starting to glow more and more! I think that means the next fragment is close by, Gus! Woohoo! Ah! Uh, where could that third star fragment be? I can't find it anywhere! <gasps> Wait! I'll just track that silly peck pod so Gus the Gummy Gator can lead me right to it! <laughs> I don't see the star fragment anywhere. Where could it be? There it is, Gus. Right down there, Gus. You're right, little gators. I see it too. Time for our next spacewalk. Gonna get the energy star. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Whoa. How did I not see that huge mountain? I better get the star fragment and get out of here! Silly Gator! I knew you would lead me straight to the next star fragment! <laughs> oh no! It's Gustav! I won't let you take the star fragment! Not so fast! Gustav got the star fragment! 
I did it! The third star fragment is all mine! Now that I have two star fragments, I'll be able to... No! Oh, what's going on? I need to get back to the pet pod! Heck, Gustav got away with the next star fragment! But I think there's an earthquake or something happening right now! I tracked your coordinates, Gus, and it looks like you landed right next to Olympus Mons! It's a volcano. It's two and a half times the height of Mount Everest. Oh my gummies! We need to get out of here quick! Olympus Mons might erupt any second! The next test results came in, Gus. The fourth star fragment is on planet Saturn. Get your gator tail out of there! You heard that, little gators! Looks like we're going to Saturn! Thanks for watching! Hope to see you next time! Bye!